Pro-life groups all around the country gathered today to protest abortions. News Channel 21's Danny Freed was at the Planned Parenthood here in Bend today and has the story. Danny. Katie, the Central Oregon Right to Life group gathered today in front of Planned Parenthood to protest the allegations that the organization has been harvesting parts from some of their aborted fetuses. Positive and negative reactions could be heard at more than 300 Planned Parenthood clinics in 47 states across the country today. The purpose? The barbarism involved not only of abortion, but then the selling for profit of baby parts for so-called medical research and for humane reasons. Recent videos allegedly show Planned Parenthood employees discussing the sale of fetal tissue for profit. Dr. Richard Thorne, a retired OBGYN here in Bend, stood in front of the Planned Parenthood clinic on Division Street with 150 others to represent the Central Oregon right to life. Not only is Planned Parenthood, in my humble opinion, hurting women and men, but the scientific community, by using so-called evil means to get to a good end, using human being parts, to so-called find the magical cure. Many protesters in Central Oregon and around the United States want lawmakers to cut off Planned Parenthood's federal funding. Realistically, how many Planned Parenthood clinics are there in the United States? Less than 700, about 675, I think. How many health care clinics do we have? 3,600. Now, I did reach out to Planned Parenthood earlier this morning, and they emailed me an official statement that they've been releasing to the media. In their statement, Planned Parenthood says, quote, These videos are a fraud intended to deceive the public, and the real agenda of these attacks has become totally clear to ban abortion and limit women's access to reproduct reproductive health care at Planned Parenthood. Katie?